In this problem, we have to compute a limit as x approaches 0. So we have a polynomial over cotangent. So if you plug in 0, um, cotangent of 0 um, is not going to work, right? And the reason is, if you're not sure, if you're not sure what to do, um, then a good first step, even before you plug in 0, is write cotangent in terms of something that you're more familiar with. So the numerator stays the same, so it's 3x to the fifth plus 2x plus 1. But cotangent is cosine over sine, right? So this is cosine of x over sine x. And now you see if you plug in 0, it does not work because then you get the sine of 0, and sine of 0 is 0, and you cannot divide by 0. So what you do next is you just do some algebra. So this is the limit as x approaches 0. And we still have this piece here. So 3x to the fifth plus 2x plus 1. We're dividing by cosine over sine. So when you do that, you multiply by the reciprocal, right? So the reciprocal of cosine over sine is sine over cosine. So it's times sine over cosine. And now we're in a position where we can actually plug in 0. Because if you plug in 0 here on the bottom, the cosine of 0 is 1. See, we couldn't do it over here, right? Because when you do it here, sine of 0 is 0. So you get a number over 0. You can't have 0 on the bottom. But now we can do it here. So now you just replace all of your x's with zeros. This is the part where you drop the limit sign. Whenever you evaluate the limit, that's when you drop your limit sign. Okay, so this is going to be 3 times 0 to the fifth, so just 0, plus 0, plus 1. Sine of 0, which is, I'll write it, sine of 0. And then cosine of 0. Good stuff. This is just 1. Sine of 0 is 0. Cosine of 0 is 1. You just get 1 times 0. So the answer ends up being zero. That's it.